Hello and welcome to another Stuart Thomas Media review with myself, Stuart Thomas. Today we're going to look at the VR box for the iPhone. So the VR box is basically a virtual reality headset that you slot your phone in and creates a virtual reality experience. It is a fraction of the cost of something like the Morpheus thing or Oculus Rift or the HTC vibrator or whatever they're called. I don't know what the names are, but it is a fraction of the cost. Rather than spending 300 pounds, you can spend 10 pounds on Amazon and get one of these. And do you know what? So far, I'm pretty impressed with it. I'm not quite sure how I'm gonna demonstrate this to you, because obviously I've got to try and show you what's on the screen and what it looks like on my head. So I'm probably gonna to have to do this strangely. I don't know. I'll work that out in a minute. Anyway, so it's pretty good. It's got adjustment straps on it, so you can adjust to your sort of head shape. And it slots over your head and plonks over your eyes like this. At the moment, I can't see a goddamn thing. But I will do when I put my phone in here. So to put your phone in, you open the slot on the side, like this, your little tray. Now, I think if I'm right in saying, that you can put multiple sizes of phone in there because it's got a little spring adjustment, but I'm not 100% certain on what phones it does and doesn't support. I'm using the iPhone 6 Plus for this. So you slot your phone in the little doodah thing like that. It's got a gap on the bottom for headphones and charging port and whatever. You slide it in and you're good to go. Obviously, you'll need to start whatever application it is that you're using, but that's how it works. So, I'm gonna cut now to me using it and hopefully showing you what I'm seeing. Be right back. So, I've figured it out. What I've done is I've attached my phone to the computer which means I can't move my head around too much, but you'll at least be able to see what's currently going on the screen. So, let me start up an age-old favorite, clay pigeon shooting. All right, here we go, so I'm gonna pop them. So you'll notice, you'll probably see two screens. I only see one, because the lenses focus it, so it's just one display such. Right, let's look around. Oh, there we are. Right, okay, let's start that game then. Right, okay, well, this is going to be really awesome now, right, isn't it? Oh, by the way, I'm using this controller, which is paired up to the iPhone as well. Oh, jeez. All right, this is going to be useless, this, isn't it? Because I can't bloody move the phone. Wait, there we are. Oh. There we are. So obviously if you're not tethered to a computer, it's significantly easier to move your head around. But considering I've got wires coming out my face, I'm doing terrible actually. No, I've not managed to hit a single one. Come on, way up. There we go, there we go. There we go, look at that, there we go. Oh, no, oh, I've got no shots left, I've got no bullets. Oh brilliant, oh, the ominous red Skies of Doom, apparently. Game over. Right. No, I'm not going to have another game of that. That's rubbish. But you can see that I'm completely immersed in what is rather a terrible graphics world. But still. Right, let's have a look at another game. Right, this game is much more immersive. It's a bit more freaky as well, so it sets me inside a space station. Look around and see the people. Hello, people. Look at him doing work. And two just chatting away. Honestly. Lay about. Oh, there we are. So we hover the uh, plane, that'll do. There we go. Right, okay. So this is a space game called something. I'm not sure. I'll put the link in the uh, comments. Oh, here we are. And it allows you to independently move your head around the spaceship and look around whilst control. Oh, I'm being shot at already. I'm controlling it with this controller. Where are they? Where are they? There's one. Oh, there's one. There's one. There he is. Right. Oh, there we go. Go on, have it, Charlie. There we are. 
but you can see it's completely immersive. You know, and for a £10 piece of kit from Amazon, it's not too bad. Oh, and by the way, if you think I sound a bit nasal, that's because this thing is currently squeezing my nose. But it's pretty comfortable. I think if I tighten the headband up, it'll probably sit a little bit further away than my uh, nose. But still, oh Jesus Christ. Sorry anyone out there who, uh, oh God. So, that is what the VR box looks like when it's in use. What do I think of it? Well, honestly, it was 10, 11 pounds. You can't go wrong with it. You know, this was 11 pounds well spent. I've let loads of people have a go and they've all really enjoyed it. And as a first experience of what virtual reality is going to be like in the future with the things like the HTC vibrator or inoculus roft or whatever it's called this is gonna be super i would buy one i did but i'm recommending you buy one if you've got an iphone or another device that supports it now the only thing i would say is that it doesn't have a trigger on the side now i know some of the other versions like the google cardboard uh, which is just a piece of cardboard, has a trigger on the side that allows you to press it and activate a button on the screen of your phone. Now, what that allows you to do is interact with the game or whatever it is you're playing or using in a different way. A lot of the apps out there at the moment need that trigger, but I personally think the best apps out there are the ones that don't need the trigger and actually support the use of these, which are iPhone controllers basically and this one is made by Steel Series, and they do a good variety of different controllers but you can see that review of this here. But as well as that if you want to know what games work well with both the VR box and the controller I've done a top five list of my favorite supported apps um, which you can see here. Brilliant. So, in summary, buy it. It's £10. Thank you. And if you like the video, don't forget to subscribe and continue watching the other videos if they suit you. Cheers.